I know you care, but don't you think for one moment I will I will let you take a joyride on my shoulders anytime you please. I'm not just a vehicle, a vessel, even a motorboat that you can visit once in a year and pretend doesn't exist for the next 364 days. I am just me, a socially challenged human who you know will only talk if you form the conversation. If you asked about my day or maybe what I had for breakfast once, just once, maybe then when you did talk to me, I wouldn't give you the cold shoulder, shun you, and just perform favors. Maybe then I wouldn't become your personal driver, your chauffeur that you don't talk to, not now, not ever, because I am not a vehicle, I am not a vessel, I'm just me. The next time you talk to me, the next time you think that I'm just your little form of transportation, the thing that you depend on, maybe once or twice a year if I'm lucky, remember, I'm not ready to take on that burden, to bicker with the angel and devil on my shoulders. Don't try and hop on that little bus of mine without providing some attention. Stop staring me down and calling me up only when life doesn't work out for you. Don't expect me to help you in life when the only thing you care about is having friends and a social life that of course does not include me. Don't pretend we are the best of friends because we both know that lies are bad, that lies fill us with the deepest regret, the fakest kind. I'm not one to accept your apology because I've waited too many years for it to happen. I'm not your vessel and I'm not ready to break free and drive you around just when you please. I'm not a train that you can go on when it best fits in your schedule. I'm not a little friend or accomplice that you can just ask to do favors when you aren't feeling up to it because you are never up to it. You are the boy who cried wolf because when I try and help you, you could have done it yourself. So when you are dying and want me to treat you like an equal, I won't be there for you. Because the last time you needed me, I was just your chauffeur. You never saw my face or knew my name. You just called up the number that was left in your phone without the caller ID and took advantage of it. You misunderstood our relationship. To me, you were always just a friend. But to you, always just something you found in the 99 cent store. Something you may play with when it best fits in your schedule. Sure, you can buy a plane ticket at any time and travel to Paris or London. But I'm not that one. And I'm not here to assist you with your basic needs, your human rights. Because guess what? I'm not a vessel made for transportation or an occasional birthday card. I'm human. A simplistic lowercase human. A human that is, <laughs> that is too lazy and misunderstood to have their own vessel or vehicle, so I become one. But I don't want to because unlike that car you just spent $60,000 on, or the cruise ship with free pina coladas in every corner, I am human and very much real.